Hi friends, today's topic of discussion is timetable for mechanical engineering second year that is the SEM number 3. So this is the exam timetable which is available on the website which shows that the exams are starting from 20th November and it will continue up to 17th December. So Tuesday the paper is M3 that is 20th November and 28 November it is thermodynamics and 4 December it is SOM that is strength of materials Tuesday that is 11th December it is production processes 1 then 17th December it is materials technology that is MT so here I have prepared a study timetable based on the exam timetable and I have prepared two timetable, we will discuss both. So the first timetable as such, uh, what I have done is I have allotted more days for subjects like SOM, that is strength of material and to maths 3, that is applied maths 3 and thermodynamics. So I have apply, uh, given more days to these three subjects and less days for production processes 1 and materials technology I have given less days. So this is the first timetable which I have prepared. So let us discuss how the distribution of days has been done. So starting from today if the subject production process 1 is taken up okay so it will be like Thursday and Friday that is 11th and 12th production process that is PP1 can be done full day today and Friday half day PP1 and Friday half day SOM and Saturday and Sunday full day that is SOM Monday that is 15th October full day materials technology and Tuesday half day materials technology Tuesday half day that is 16th October, Maths 3 half day and Wednesday and Thursday full day Maths 3, Friday full day production processes 1 and Saturday that is 20th October thermodynamics and 21st October also thermodynamics. So then what I have done that is material technology and production processes I have given 1 1 days and SOM maths 3 and thermodynamics I have given 2 2 days so as you can see Monday it is material technology full day Tuesday and Wednesday it is SOM that is 23rd October and 24th October Thursday again production process is 1 Friday Saturday it is maths 3 then 28th October that is materials technology then Monday and Tuesday that is 29th and 30th October it will be thermodynamics. 31st half day production process is 1 and half day SOM and Thursday full day that is 1st November SOM. Friday half day it will be materials technology and half day it will be maths 3 and Saturday full day maths 3. Then on Sunday that is 4th November half day production process is 1 and half day thermodynamics and Monday that is 5th of November it will be full day thermodynamics Tuesday that is 6th of November half day it will be material technology and half day SOM and on Wednesday that is 7th November it will be SOM Thursday half day that is 8th of November production process is 1 and half day maths 3 Friday full day it will be maths 3 Saturday 10th of November half day material technology and half day thermodynamics Sunday 11th of November thermodynamics full day Monday that is 12th of November it will be production processes 1 and SOM for half day because now exams are approaching so we have given half day half day for all the subjects so Tuesday material technology and thermodynamics half day Wednesday that is 14th November production process is 1 and material technology and from 15th you can start studying those subjects which are coming for the examination like first paper which is 
maths 3 you can start studies from 15th of november so this was the first timetable okay which i have prepared considering that som okay that is strength of material and maths 3 and thermodynamics will require more days compared to production processes 1 and material technology second timetable which i have prepared i have prepared considering that i have given equal number of days to all the subjects so let us see that timetable also so here this is the exam timetable which is there on website and here in this timetable study timetable i have given equal number of days to all the subjects so let's review that so starting from today two full days that is thursday and friday 11th october and 12th october it will be som that is strength of material 13th october 14th october it will be production processes one monday and tuesday that is 15th and 16th october it will be materials technology wednesday and thursday that is 17th october and 18th october it will be maths 3 and Friday and Saturday thermodynamics that is 19th and 20th October 21st October and 22nd October that is Sunday and Monday it will be SOM Tuesday and Wednesday that is 23rd and 24th October it will be production processes for two full days then Thursday and Friday that is 25th October and 26th October it will be materials technology and on Sunday that is 27th okay Saturday that is 27th and Sunday that is 28th it will be full day maths 3 and then Monday and Tuesday that is 29th and 30th October it will be thermodynamics Wednesday and Thursday 31st uh, October and 1st November it will be SOM then Friday and Saturday that is 2nd November and 3rd November it will be production processes 1 and Sunday and Monday that is 4th November and 5th November it will be material technology for two full days then Tuesday, Wednesday, again maths 3, that is 6th November and 7th November. Thursday and Friday, that is 8th November and 9th November, thermodynamics. Then Saturday, that is 10th November and Sunday, that is 11th November. Okay, so Saturday you will have SOM. I have given because exams are approaching. So what I have done, one one day I have given for each subject. That is Saturday, SOM and Sunday, production process 1, that is 11th November. On Monday, it will be Material Technology, that is 12th November. And Tuesday, it will be Maths 3. And Wednesday, that is 14th November, it will be Thermodynamics. Then, what will happen? Each subject will receive 7 days, as you can see over here. Production Processes 1, SOM, Material Technology, Maths 3 and Thermodynamics, all will have 7 days for studies. And after 14th, from 15th, you can start studying for the subject which are coming as per the timetable like maths is coming as first so you can start studying from 15th maths so that you are prepared up to 20th okay for that particular subjects because as such for every subject you have sufficient days for studies so you can utilize those days so this was the timetable considering that you are giving equal time for all the subjects and earlier timetable was prepared based on considering that SOM maths 3 and thermodynamics will require more days so this was the study timetable okay, suggested by me but you can change according to your requirement and your conditions and based on the studies which you have done for all the subjects so you can allot more days or less days i will again prepare another timetable when exams are very close so that hourly basis timetable can be prepared okay so hope you like the video. We will again meet in the next video very soon. Till then, goodbye.